Here at 530, I'm Evan Millward. Cincinnati survivors of childhood sexual abuse made their way up to Columbus today. There are several bills proposed to help victims. They just aren't moving forward. Our state house reporter Morgan Trow is at the Capitol urging lawmakers where this group, I should say, is urging lawmakers to do more. Child sex abuse victims say many of them don't get the justice that they deserve and that Ohio statute of limitations laws actually prevent their abusers from being held accountable. Ohio is probably the safest place for a hidden predator to hunt. From the ages of 8 to 10, Paul Nyer was repeatedly sexually abused by his Cincinnati priest. 32 years later, he began to take his life back. It was just unreal, the amount of freedom that came from just saying, I was raped. His testimony helped convict Jeff Drew of nine counts of rape, and he was able to do so because he was inside Ohio statute of limitations. Child USA states the average age of a child survivor coming forward is 52, but criminal charges must be brought before the victim turns 43 and civil cases before 30. Nyer was 41. They said it was only an act of God that I was able to get in there. Our God's really protecting in a place where this happened to me. These antiquated laws are still in place. Advocacy group Ohioans for Child Protection held a conference at the State House, urging lawmakers to pass bills to help survivors. At the beginning of 2021, Democrats introduced House Bill 266, which would eliminate the statute of limitations. But it hasn't had even one hearing. Other bills around child sex abuse prevention have also stalled. The survivors fall on each side of the political spectrum, saying that this isn't a Democrat versus Republican issue. We are asking lawmakers to do something. Show Ohioans you will protect children and not the predators in the institutions that enable them. We reached out to the state house leaders and religious based lobbying groups the survivors addressed, but no one responded. None attended the event either. Do I ever feel like I fully made it to my potential? Absolutely not. Am I clawing my way up to that potential? Every day. Lawmakers credit our reporting for one of these child abuse prevention laws moving forward. These survivors hope that it will be able to be passed once the election is over. At the State House, I am Morgan Trow reporting.